Kelly. So I'm going to just be standing up here because there's. Scott, thank you for joining us. We're back to winning ways in the league. I can imagine that's a great feeling. Can I get your reflection on the game first? Uh, yeah, didn't like the game. I uh, didn't enjoy it at all. Um, I felt that we um, we probably made less passes in the second half, but were better. Um, believe it or not, I thought we made a lot of passes second. Uh, sorry, first half and kind of got captured a lot and trapped. And they pressed really well. We didn't do the right thing. Um, and I felt that we went a little more direct in the second half, but it was needed because of their press. Um, we played down the sides of them a little bit better. Um, so yeah, I didn't like the first half at all. I felt it was end to end. Obviously, didn't like the start. Um, poor goal to give away after 90 seconds. Um, you know, disappointed with that. But we we continued to try and play the right way. I just felt that we we didn't do the right things at the right times today, especially in that first half. I felt thought we played we played better in the second half with actually not passing it that much, but it was needed. Yeah, needed, but we obviously got the three points. It must be a great feeling because, you know, the performances that we've had of late, have, as we said many times, haven't been bad ones. And tonight, today, we've finally been rewarded, haven't we? Yeah, for sure. Um, we have, and we created quite a bit today as well. I thought there could have been more goals as well. You know, I know we scored three, um, but there could have been more. Um, but yeah, um, really, really pleased to get back to winning ways. Danilo Orsi's on top form, obviously he's going to take a lot of the plaudits today. It must be a great feeling having a striker, you know, that's you know really found form now. He's obviously picking up with a few goals, you know, here and there at the start of the season, but he's now really sort of hit form, isn't he? Yeah, I think that's nine, is it? Is it nine in 16 games, I believe? So, good return, right? Great lad. Deserves it, works his absolute socks off every, every day. Um, I'm really pleased for him and he's been brilliant, you know. Um, so, yeah, really pleased for him. Jay Williams come back in was brilliant. They sent back. Obviously, we've had to move a few things around with injuries. You know, it must be you know pleasing for you as a manager to know that you can rely on these players to come back in and put in shifts for for 90 minutes, even having missed a game for injury. Yeah, of course. You know, Jay's a, he's a warrior. You know, he's a tough kid, um, and I thought he was good today. I thought he played in that central role really well today, alongside Glad's dropping in, um, and obviously the outside centre halves in Will and, and, and Lawrence. Um, I thought we looked solid actually, um, especially in the second half. I thought first half we were a little open, turned it over a lot, and of course the first goal I was really disappointed with. But you know, their XG would be quite low. I would think. I don't think it'll be anything to, to write home about. Whereas ours will be okay, you know. So pleased with that. Um, but yeah, pleased with Jay. Thanks, go. Hi Scott, yeah, it felt like quite a scrappy game. There seemed to be a lot of challenges that seemed to go sort of ignored by the referee. And now I don't want to get you in any kind of trouble on that, but what, what were your view on some of the challenges that were let go? It seemed just horrific, just mm. horrific. You know, there was a, a foul before they scored. We've probably been playing 30 seconds on Adam Campbell. It's so clear, it's untrue, and he's just, and it's right in front of the linesman, just play on. I yeah. thought oh, that was strange, mm. you know, and, and it kind of carried on throughout the game for me. Yeah. Um, but no, I don't, I don't want to say too much more than that, really. Yeah, fair enough. Um, Luca, obviously his first um, start um, in the league this year. Um, what were your view on his performance? Yeah, tonight? good. Yeah, I thought he'd done, I thought he'd done extremely well. Um, we had two league debuts today. In, yes. In yeah. Addy and, and Luca, so you know, it's a big, big positive for the football club and a big plus for for me. Uh, as a manager, you know we, we want to see players come through and make their league debuts and, and and do well. And I thought they both did really well today. Yeah, and uh, yeah, Addy particularly he came on. Did he do everything you needed him to do when he came on for his short stint? Yeah, for sure. He worked hard. He made tackles. He passed it nicely. He's a good player. You know, yeah. he can play in a lot of positions. Play wide left. Play wide right. Two number ten. He probably plays as a striker. Mm. He's got good ability. He'd probably play him as a midfield player. He makes tackles. He runs. He's quick. Um, he's a very good player. Yeah, and we t we've talked a lot this week about um, being soft letting in soft goals. How frustrating was that first goal today? Yeah, really, really frustrating because we we've done a lot of work this week on kind of showing the opposition away from the goal, and you know you saw it after ninety seconds where he come inside on on his stronger foot to shoot. Um, so disappointed with that, and I know the players were as well. Um, but we we continued with. You know, with how we play and, and try to do the right thing by putting it right, which they did. So, you know, sometimes you're not going to get every action spot on. Um, disappointed with it, but we will get better. We will get better because I know the work that we're going to do.
Yeah. And on the flip side, Will Wright, what a strike. <laughs> yeah, great finish, wasn't it? Yeah. You know, just found himself in the middle of the pitch somehow um, driving towards the goal and it opened up perfect for him. And he, you know, I always fancied him once, once I could see that he was going to shoot. You, you kind of knew that it's not going to be too far away because of the, the ability that he's got, you know. Um, but unbelievable finish, yeah. Yeah, and on a slightly lighter note, Ronan Darcy's haircut, what do you think? I actually think he looks all right. Yeah. Um, you know, he's going to get sponsored by Slazinger as he looks like a tennis ball. <laughs> um, but no, uh, yeah, I think he looks all right. I, yeah. think he, I think it suits him. Brilliant, thanks, Scott. Thank you. Thank you. Scott, you spoke just then about the opposition's XG being lower. I thought it was a really uh, good performance in the second half, particularly at the back. How much of a positive is that now going forward, as you spoke as well on Tuesday, saying... You don't want to leak as many goals. Yeah, really positive. I think that we were disappointed to concede after 90 seconds, you know, after the work we've done this week. Um, but we kind of put it put it to bed quickly and we carried on um, playing our way as, as best as we could. Um, and I thought defensively in the second half especially, I thought we were a lot better. I thought we were open in the first half, but I don't think we played well the first half. I thought we made, like I say, I thought we made more passes in the first half than we did the second, but I thought we were better in the second you know, I think we we didn't because they pressed really well. We didn't play down the sides of them enough for me. We didn't get kind of in behind them and make them or ask questions of them too many times in the first half. And I felt we did that better in the second half. Having the trio of Lolos, Orsi, and Campbell all starting, especially with the chances you created today, how much of a threat can that be going forward? It's a big threat. You know, all all, all three of them can score. All three of them can make goals. You know, and off the back of that, you've got you know some good players to, to, to kind of come on as well. You know, in mm -hmm. Ronan Darcy, obviously, um, Addy can play in them positions as well. You know, we've got Raf missing at the moment through illness. Um, you know, Cam Sawyer um, can can make a difference in them positions as well. You know, Rolsey, obviously, he he was uh, due to to be part of the squad today, but um, got injured, um, kind of. From training yesterday, so um, one we missed there. So we, we've got players who, who can hurt oppositions in, that, in them positions. You know, we've got good numbers in them positions. Back to winning ways, back to back wins as well, including the cup uh, midweek. How big is that now going into Barrow next week? It's the best feeling um, as a manager, uh, and of course all the players and um, everybody that works hard every day because um, there's nothing better than. You know, working towards a game and then coming away with a win. You know, it's everything you work for, um, especially after the run of form we've had in terms of results. Um, it was important we won, we won the game today. I don't particularly think the performance was great, but a win's, you know, at this stage of the season and what's kind of happened in the past is, is really important. Brilliant. Cheers, Scott. Thank you.